Well, congratulations to Coach uh, Muschamp and the Gators. They did a great job today. Uh, physically whipped us. It's probably the best description that I could give you. Um, I felt like uh, we started out pretty good. Um, had a nice touchdown drive. Had some moved the ball decently well in the first quarter. Uh, but then uh, after that, didn't get a whole lot going in the first half. Uh, defensively played pretty well to begin with. Uh, got them into that field goal situation. Of course, they faked the field goal, scored the touchdown, grabbed momentum, uh, and then just really kind of took off from there. They uh, played uh, very well. We did Mark, y'all's run defense has really been strong for about a year and a half. What what went wrong today? Well, I'd have to watch the film to know exactly <clears throat> what happened. I know there were, there were times when it looked like we were fairly stout up, up the gut and a couple things bounced. You know, some of the bigger runs bounced outside. Uh, so we didn't really play the edge like we, like, like we ought to. But, I mean, when you run for 400 yards, just, they, they did a good job, period. Just, they just executed better than we did. Mark, I know you guys are always on guard for both some field goals. Tonsils. How surprised were you by the fake? Well, it, um, I'm never surprised when somebody tries a fake. Um, you know, they executed it well. They saw something uh, that we were vulnerable to, and they, they, they planned it, they executed they called it, and executed it. Big key, you know, they wouldn't make a turn it over like they've been doing all year. And the freshman quarterback, I guess, he just played within the system, did it? Well, you know, we got a, we got a turnover early and had a chance to score. It would have been nice to get a touchdown there. Didn't get a touchdown, got in field goal position, and uh, <coughs> didn't make the kick. Um, so we got no points off that turnover. And then we had at least one, one turnover, didn't we? Was it one for us? Yeah. Yeah, so, uh, but, you know, they, they didn't have to really take many chances. They were able to keep the score the way they liked it. They were able to run, keep the ball on the ground. And, uh, I mean, the wind was definitely a factor. I mean, it was it was blowing hard for both teams. and It wasn't going to be pretty trying to throw or kick it, quite frankly. But, um, you know, later in the game, the wind died down a little bit and helped. But, uh, you know, they didn't – we never put – them in a position where they had to throw the ball, quite frankly. So I don't blame them for, I don't blame them for only throwing six times. What was the difference between, in your opinion, what your offense was able to do in the first quarter and the last three? Oh, gosh. You know, you just got to look at the film sometimes just to see exactly what happened. There was a couple uh, times where it ended up being a third and one or less, a third and two or less, uh, excuse me, at the end, uh, at the end of three downs, uh, it was uh, got down to fourth and one or less, and maybe uh, could have gone for on fourth down a couple times. But uh, I was early in the game, you know, about midfield, decided you know to try to punt the ball down, which we didn't do very good. We we punted it decent. We got a little bit of field position, but not not much. Um, I was hoping to pin them back a little bit deeper a couple of those times early on, but um, uh, we just. We just were not able to get it going. Did you have a good look at your field goal? I was watching it. I thought it was good. Our kickers thought it was good. You know, of course, most kickers will say that, but uh, our holder thought it was good. Um, you know, when you kick it so high, I guess it's difficult to, to have a feel for it. And, and I was asking if that's a reviewable play, and I'm sitting there going, I just don't know um, if it's worth using a timeout for uh, there was a, a break, I think, if I'm not mistaken, a TV timeout or whatever. And there's plenty of time for somebody to take a look at it. So, But, um, I mean, our guys thought it was good. It was very close. The, the official said that uh, it felt like the ball went over the top, right over the top of the upright, which I think, and they're, if they think it would hit the upright at all, I think they, they gauge it as a miss. So I think that's what they thought they saw. Coach, talk about that. Uh... 61 so early and he's in the game, out of the game. How that yeah, well, that, 
That's a problem. You know, David is a great player. David Andrews uh, has been a great leader for us. Uh, he's been a you know, mainstay for us at that center position. And, uh, you know, he makes a lot of things go for us. And uh, he gutted it out with that sprained ankle. Uh, Hunter did come in and, and did some nice things. Uh, I, I can't say exactly what happened uh, while Hunter was in there all the time because uh, it's just he's right in the middle of it. It's hard to see from my vantage point. But, um, you know, we had no fumbled snaps that I can remember with him. And, and um, if I'm not mistaken, he – was he in there on the drive? We were trying to get the field goal, possibly. I just don't remember when he was in there. But we moved the ball a little bit one drive while he was in there. I think it was the one we tried the attempt at the field goal. But then David, you know, wrapped it up tight and, and finished it for us.